Now, we all know that May is Lupus Awareness Month. That's a disease that affects over 1.5 million people here in the United States, including Shannon Box. She's an Olympic gold medalist and Women's World Cup winner. Box was diagnosed with lupus in 2008 and went public with her disease in 2012. Uh, Chris Harry caught up with the South Torrance High School native and the graduate to hear about uh, raising lupus awareness and also her involvement in the return to women's soccer here in L.A. Hometown Hero, sponsored by Rotolo Chevrolet. So Shannon, a, a three-time gold medalist, four World Cups, and it all started here in Southern California. Uh, what was it like growing up here and just memories of playing soccer and all sorts of sports? Growing up in LA, I wouldn't change a thing. I had such a great childhood um, and sports was always at the front forefront of that. I mean, basketball, tag, football, baseball, it didn't matter what we were doing. We were always competing and playing something and sports really defined who I was. It made me competitive. It gave me, you know, a goal. It gave me like, pretty much a focus of what I wanted to do later in life. So Shannon, we're here for a very important month, Lupus Awareness Month. Uh, first and foremost, what is lupus? Lupus is a chronic disease that causes inflammation throughout your entire body, inflammation and pain. And so autoimmune um, is where your body pretty much is attacking your healthy tissues. It affects your skin, your joints, your muscles, and, and your organs. You were diagnosed really right in the middle of your career. What was that like to go through that while participating in such a high stakes career? Scary. I just remember going through trainings and barely being able to move, barely being able to walk up my set of stairs. I lived on the second floor and I, I just remember having to rest halfway through. And as a professional athlete, I was like, what is going on with me? I was very quiet about it because I was, you know, playing a sport at a high level and fatigue was my biggest symptom. Extreme fatigue was my biggest symptom. How do you tell a coach, I have extreme fatigue, I don't know when it's gonna hit, but I'm here and you know, I still wanna play. You know, for a coach, I mean, it's hard to say like, okay, we're gonna let you play in a World Cup final, but we don't know if you're gonna feel sick that day. We talk about perseverance, in, especially in, in your field, uh, the, the perseverance to get to that next level, to have something like this on top of it, how do you think it, it further strengthened just the person you are today? It strengthened me. I mean, just to be able to know that, okay, I can still play and do what I want. I think that was the biggest thing is like, I wanted to play soccer. Was I gonna let this stop me? I didn't want it to, you know? But I also was very aware, like everybody that has lupus has it in a very different way. I look and seem normal. I'm playing at a high level. I could see people being like, Lupus, what's that? Like, oh, it must not be that bad. Now living in Portland, Oregon, Box is a member of the Lupus Foundation's Pacific Northwest Regional Council and is a leader in helping raise lupus awareness. We are in the right direction. And I think that's because we have more and more people that are advocating for it. Right now, there is no cure for this. And so people are dying and there's, you know, 1.5 million people in America have it. That's a lot. Like, so we need to make sure that we are bringing more awareness to it. And the final thing, your affiliation with Angel oh, City Angel FC. City. Tell me all about it. I am so excited. Oh my gosh. Um, you know, I'm, I'm still a Southern California kid at heart. I'm just so excited that we get to bring something back to LA for our community so that they can enjoy the women's game. And it gives me a great excuse to come back a lot in the summer.